The right-hand man of the Pirate King, the Dark King, the one and only, Silvers Rayleigh. Rayleigh met Roger after he stole a ship due to his house burning down and needing a place to live. Roger said that it was a fated meeting and asked Rayleigh to join him. At first, Rayleigh declined, later on, he formed a bond with Roger and became his first mate and have a great adventure with the Roger Pirates they ventured into the Grand Line together and conquered it. After Roger disbanded his crew and turned himself in, Rayleigh settled down in the Sabaeity Archipelago. He met Boa Hancock and her sisters, Sandersonia and Marigold, and helped them to find their way back to Amazon Lily by calling Gloriosa. Rayleigh became a coding mechanic on Sabaeity Archipelago, he specializes in coating ships with Yurukaman resin, a process which enables ships to travel to Fishman Island. And at some point formed a business partnership with Shikuyaku, later, Silvers married Shikuyaku. Rayleigh pretended to become a slave to steal money to made customers of the human auction house cancel orders and demanded refunds. He is later encountered by the protagonist Monkey D. Luffy and his crew as they navigate through the Sabaeity Archipelago. Shikuyaku stated that he was 100 times stronger than all of the 11 supernovas by the time they first arrived on the Sabaeity. As Luffy and his crew try to escape, Rayleigh holds off Admiral Kazaru, even at his old age, Rayleigh have the strength and speed to stop Admiral Kazaru who currently have one of the most powerful and fastest Logia Devil Fruit in the series. However, Rayleigh himself has admitted that he is not as young as he used to be and can tire in battle. And after Whitebeard's death, Rayleigh swim outside the calm belt and was capable of killing several sea kings with his bare hands even after swimming to Amazon Lily for Luffy and met the former Shichibukai Jinbei as well reunite with Hancock, her sisters, and Gloriosa. He trains Luffy to learn hockey in Ruzikana, the northwest of Amazon Lily. At the latest chapter of One Piece manga, Silver's Rayleigh save Boa Hancock from the one of the four Emperor Blackbeard. His reputation alone was enough to have Blackbeard who had spent two years mastering the Yami Yami Nomi and the Gura Gura Nomi, to retreat. However, Rayleigh later revealed he didn't think he would actually defeat Blackbeard in a fight. Obviously, he would lose against Blackbeard but it would severely weaken Blackbeard to the point where he would be vulnerable. Throughout the series, Rayleigh is portrayed as a powerful swordsman and hockey user. He possesses all three types of hockey, observation hockey, armament hockey, and conqueror's hockey. His observation hockey allows him to sense the presence of others, even if they are trying to hide or remain undetected. Rayleigh has demonstrated the ability to effortlessly predict his opponent's movements and intentions, making him a formidable opponent in combat. He can sense and react to attacks before they happen, granting him a significant advantage. Silver's Rayleigh's armament hockey, is depicted as incredibly strong and formidable. He has shown tremendous mastery over this form of hockey, which allows him to imbue his attacks with a powerful force and bypass the defenses of his opponents. His mastery allows him to effectively defend against and counter powerful attacks. Silver's Rayleigh's conquering hockey, is depicted as exceptionally powerful and rare. This form of hockey allows the user to exert their willpower over others, essentially dominating their minds and rendering them unconscious or even making them submit to the user's commands. Rayleigh has demonstrated his mastery of conquering hockey on multiple occasions. He was able to effortlessly knock out numerous opponents without even direct physical contact, simply by releasing his hockey. This ability showcases the immense strength of his willpower and his control over this hockey. It's important to note that Conker's Hockey is considered a rare and extraordinary ability, possessed by only a select few individuals. This further emphasizes the greatness of Rayleigh's Conker's Hockey, as it sets him apart as one of the most formidable characters in the series. Think about it, an old man can fight an admiral equally at the age of 76, and scared a Yonko and make him retreat at the age of 78. So how strong actually Rayleigh in his prime, strong as admiral, probably no, for me, safe to say strong as emperor. Maybe a little bit lower than current shanks. And stronger than most of powerful characters in one piece.